true. Oh my goodness. Eh, proseguimos entonces, Miss Flor. Sí, ahora sí, gracias. Okay, okay, thank you. Bueno, never happened that to me. Okay, sorry. Oh my God. Anyways, um, my day, Espinosa. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, how you doing? I good. Good. Uh, because the weekend is coming. Yes, we have yes. the weekend ahead. Yes, we have ahead. the weekend ahead. We have the weekend in the corner. You deserve your Saturday and your Sunday, your family day, right? Family day. All right. Yes. All right. Any plans, my day? Any plans? I am going to rest. You're going to rest as much as possible, right? As much as possible. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Uh, uh, convivir con my family. Spend time. Spend time with my family. Mm -hmm. You're going to mm -hmm. spend time with your family. That's great. That's great. Yes. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, no gentlemen, but ladies, thank you for coming to the class. We only have three students. Okay. Well, Today, we're going to actually double check a present perfect. Um, let's go over this video, please. Hi, in this lesson, we will study present perfect with already and yet. Ask and answer questions in present perfect with irregular and regular past participles. I want you to concentrate on this new tense. Notice how it is formed. Pay close attention to the words already and yet. Present perfect, already, yet. The present perfect is formed with the verb have plus the past participle. Okay, that's the formula right there, okay? Present perfect is formed with the verb have, okay? And first, we need to conjugate have, yes? have you can say i have you have we have and they have correct what about he she it he has has she has, has. And it has. has. Remember, to start with, we all have to be clear on that. Okay? I have, you have, he, she, it has, we have, they have. Is that clear? Clear, clear like crystal water or clear like horchata? Clear. clear, clear, clear. Water. As water. Okay, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So what's next? What is next is the past participle verb. The past participle verb. That's that's what is coming next. Okay, let me listen. Let me listen to past participle verbs. Yes? Adelie, can you mention one past participle verb? Written. Written. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Catherine, can you mention a past participle verb? Um, call it. Called. 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 Like C A L L E D. Yes, yes. Okay, called. Okay. Um, Maide, go ahead. Black play. Plate. Plate. Okay. Plate. Okay. Nice. Nice. So that's what you need right there. Okay. Subject. Depending on the subject, have or has plus past participle verb. 
Have you been to a jazz club? Yes, I've been to several. No, I haven't been to one. Has she ridden in a streetcar? Yes, she's ridden in one. No, she hasn't ridden in one. Has he called home lately? Yes, he's called twice this week. No, he hasn't called in months. Have they eaten dinner yet? Yes, they've already eaten. No, they haven't eaten yet. Contractions I've equals I have. You've equals you have. He's equals he has. She's equals she has. It's equals it has. We've equals we have. They've equals they have. Haven't equals have not. Hasn't equals has not. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, For present perfect. Please remember, please remember this part. Affirmatives, the contractions. Do you have any question on the contractions, on the pronunciation? Any, anything difficult for you? No? What about the contraction of we have? What is the contraction? With. With. Okay. Sounds perfect. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Can you help me with the contraction of they have? Dave. Outstanding. Thank you so much. So that's clear, right? Ladies, Catherine, Adelie, it's clear. Now, when it's negative, haven't or hasn't. hasn't. But don't forget that after this, you still need, you still need the PP verb, the past participle verb. No, I haven't been to the United States. No, I haven't eaten that type of food. No, I haven't gone there. Okay, so that's for you to have an have idea. Have not. Hasn't okay, equals let's move on. has not. Let's okay. pass participle verb. This is something very important, okay? Have or has. Plus PP verb. Plus complement. The verb have or has will depend on the person we'll talk about. Okay, and this, we use the present perfect when we want to express actions which begun, they, they started in the past and they continue in the present. For example, can you read the example for us? Catherine Ramirez, can you read the example about she? Repeat, please. The example. Can you read the example? Uh, uh huh. Um. Okay. Um. She. 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 At the bottom. At the bottom. She has. Uh, okay. She has um. Driven. At the work. Driven, driven, driven. No, it says she has worked in the bank for five years. She has worked in the bank for five years. So I have a question for you. Listen to the example. She has worked in the bank for five years. So I have a question for you. Ladies, based on this example, she has worked in the bank for five years. I have a question. Did she, did she um, stop working in the bank? Hello? No. 
No, no. she didn't. No, she, she didn't. didn't. Uh, I have another question. Is she still working at this bank? Yes. Yes, she is. She. Repeat, yes, she is. Yes, she is. Correct. So, if that's clear, let's go to the next example. Next example, my day, please help us. The last one. He have. He has mm. car. Mm -hmm. No. We have. We have had, correct? Ah, uh, have. No, es que. No se como ve bien. Va en el. 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 el she. It. It. Y he, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Es, es con has. Uh -huh, uh -huh. En, entonces es he has. Uh, no sé. <laughs> ok, pero no sé. estamos ahorita en el último ejemplo. The last example. We. Ah, uh, we have. Ajá, uh -huh. can you read it, please? Ah, uh, ok. We have. And um, the same car for the years. Mm, I didn't. I didn't understand. Had when? You, can you repeat? Have. We. Can you repeat? We have. We have have the same car for the years. The same. Repeat. The same. The same. The same car. The same car for? Car. You need car. to put like pronunciation right there, miss. Car. Car. <laughs> Repeat. We have had. We have we had. Have. We have had. Yes. We have had. The same car. The same car. For how long? For 10 years 10 years do you understand ladies Adeli, anna do you understand yes yes so i have a question he says we have had it's like like the family right it's it's the, the cars the family card okay so i have a question um do they have a car right now Yes, the same car. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. <laughs> they they do. still have the same car. <laughs> it's a little old now. It's 10 years, but, you know, it's working. So they still have the same car. So they bought it. Yes, they bought it 10 years ago. They bought it 10 years ago. And they still have it. So they have had, they have had the same car for 10 years. Hmm. Interesting. Me, I can say I have, um, I have lived, I live in Mexicanos, San Salvador, right? So I can say I have lived, I have lived in uh, Mexicanos city for all my life. Yes, do you understand? So it's an action that started in the past and continues in the present. Um, for example, I have worked, I have worked with Insafor since 2015. Okay, do you understand? And right now we are in 2022 and I continue working for Insafor. So it's an action that continues in the present. I have studied English. You can say that example. I have studied English for what? How long have you studied English? You can make an idea to practice. Okay, so follow the examples follow the examples 
Um, let's 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 watch the rest because I want you to see already. I want you to see already and yet. I want you to see because you have a you have a question for me, right? That was your whole plus complement. The verb have or has will depend on the person we will talk about. We use present perfect when we want to express actions which began in the past and continue in the present. Example, she has worked in the bank for five years. We have had the same car for 10 years. When we want to make reference to an unfinished temporary period of time, I have worked hard this week. It has rained a lot this year. We haven't seen her today. Repeated actions in a specific period of time between the present and the past. They have seen that film six times. We have eaten all that restaurant many times. When timing is not relevant or it is unknown, someone has eaten my soup. Now let's talk about already and yet. Already usually goes after have or has and before the main verb. Examples, we have already had our breakfast. When are you going to do your homework? But I've already done it. Yet means that something that we expected has happened or hasn't happened. We usually put it at the end of a sentence. Examples, has the post arrived yet? Have you done your homework? Not yet. Haven't you got ready yet? Look at the time. Okay, ladies, practice time. You have a question from me, remember? Using have, right? You have an interesting question that you prepared. Correct. It's, it was only one question. Yes, my dear, Anna, Catherine, you got it? You got it? Okay, I have my question already. So I hope you have your question. Uh, let's start with the conversation, okay? I want you to try to use already, okay? Remember, already is in affirmatives, okay? I have already done that. She has already done that, okay? Yet, it's in the question and in uh, negative sentences usually, okay? So, my question is, have you, okay, have you learned to play an instrument? Have you learned to play an instrument? Let's start with my day. Go ahead. Have you learned to play an instrument yet? Not. Not I. I have. I'm sorry. Not. No learn. Uh, no, I haven't. Will. Repeat. No, I, no haven't. I haven't. No, I haven't. Uh huh. And then, or you can say, "No, I haven't learned yet." Learn. Repeat. No, I haven't, no learned. I haven't learned yet. No, I haven't learned it. Learned. Learn. Yet. Let me chat it here. Let me chat it here. No. Let me chat. No, I haven't. I haven't learned yet. No, I haven't learned yet. Okay. Do you understand? Okay. Learned okay. yet. Okay. Have you, okay, past participle of the verb see, S-E-E. -E. What is the past participle? Hello? The verb see, like see you. Uh huh. What is the past participle? So. No, is this the just saw is the simple past? I don't know. You don't know? That's a basic verb, ladies. Se sim? Sim? What? Sin. Sim. So see, so sin. Sin. S-E-E-N. Sin. 
Okay. Same. Have you seen any movie at the cinema these last days? Catherine? Um, yes, I've uh, seen movies at cinema. Um, okay, okay, okay. You don't really need to repeat all my compliment, but you can use your personal experience, your information. The first part, yes. The first part, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I have yes, seen. I I have, I have seen. seen, and you give more details. I have seen um, Spider-Man's movie. Yeah. Ah, okay. Or, or yes, I have seen a movie with my friends. Yes. Yes, I have seen a movie uh, last month. Yeah, I have seen a movie. Okay. Okay. Practice makes perfect. Let me go with Adelie. My question is, have you done a good action today? Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. No es porque no la haya hecho, es porque estoy procesando la estructura de la sentence. <laughs> okay. Have okay. you done any positive action? action today yes i have done mm -hmm. i yeah i como se llama? yes i have done i i teach my students okay that's perfect that's perfect now that's a very nice question because in the answer, you can expand the information. And there, Adelie, Catherine, Anna, and Maide, there is where you show your knowledge. Why? Because you answer in present perfect. Yes, I have need, done a positive change. action. Wait, and then, repeat, I have done a positive action. Repeat, guys. I have, I have done, done a positive, a positive action. action. I have done a positive done, action. Done, done, do, did, to. done, mm. I have, I've, I've done, repeat, I've, I've done. done a positive action. Done repeat, a positive. I've done a I've positive done. action. I've done. Comma, I've comma. And then, and then, yeah. Adelie? Simple pass, simple pass, I, because the action finished. Okay. You confirm, you confirm in present perfect. Yes, I've done a positive action. Okay, comma, comma, and then more information. You need simple past after that. You mentioned a verb, teach. I teach. What is the simple pass of teach? Taught, no, taught, 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 excellent, okay. taught, taught. I taught my students. Correct. I okay. taught many classes to my students today. So can you repeat the complete answer overall now, Adelie? You want to practice? You want to do that role play? The question yeah. is, the question is, pay attention, guys. Have you done any positive action today, Adelie? Yes, I have done a positive action. I taught many, many lessons, many lessons to my students. Yes, you got it. You got it. You got it. That, that is intermediate. That is intermediate. You are mixing uh, present perfect and then simple pass. But it's, it is so hard. It's it better hard. to talk in simple present all the time. <laughs> we have to do it. I we know. have to do it. You have to, you have to grow. You have I to know. grow. You have to keep growing. Yes? No. You don't want to get stuck. 
You don't want to get stuck. You want to move forward. Yes, you want to move forward. It's difficult, but you know, with practice, suddenly, like everything, practice makes perfect, right? It's your turn. Is your turn. Oh, wait, Ana, Ana Lopez, can you hear me, Ana? Are you there? Okay, I have a question for you. You ready? Yes. Nice, nice. My question is. Have you spoken English today? You're processing the question like Adelie, right? You're processing the question. I know. I'm giving you your time. I know. Um, no, I don't. Uh, don't? Is that what you said? Me cuesta, como le digo eso? Me cuesta ir al final, porque antes debe confirmarme in present perfect because the tense is present perfect. Yes, I have done. Done? No, perdón, no, I, I have done. Wait, wait, wait. Listen to the question because in the question you have to catch the PP verb. Katherine, Anna, my day, Adelie. That's key. That's key. That's very important. When, uh, when you listen to the question, your job is to okay. catch the verb, I, the PP verb. I have spoken. Done. Spoken. spoken. Forget okay. about done. That was with Adelie. Have you done any positive activity? That was her. That was her scenario. Now it's you. It's different. Your verb is spoken. Okay. Yes. Have, I you have you spoken English spoken. today? Spoken English today. Uh huh. Uh, yes or no? Yes or no? Yes, yes. 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 Confirmation. I have, spoken. I have spoken. I've spoken. Whichever way you prefer. Normal way, I have spoken. Repeat, I have spoken. Yes, I have spoken. Contracted. Yes, I've spoken English today. Yes, I've spoken English today. More information, yes, I've spoken English with my classmates today during lunch. Okay, yes. <laughs> repeat, repeat. The teacher, I can no puedo procesar, estoy, estoy dopada. Ah, uh -huh. are you okay? <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Pay us attention <laughs> then. No <laughs> worries. <laughs> no worries, <laughs> me. Take it easy. I have spoken English with my classmate. Very well. So spoken, spoken <laughs> is the verb in the question. Okay. 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 Very well. Now is your turn, guys and ladies. Ladies, it's your turn. You need to tell me your question. Katherine, make your question for the class, to the class. Present perfect. Uh, okay. Um, um, have you thought in the moment? In, is, uh -huh. Have you thought, uh, pensar? That's how se pronuncia? Thought. Thought. Think. Thought. Think, that's a difficult verb. Think, thought. In the past participle is the same than the simple past. Thought, thought. Have you, have you thought? Have you have thought? You, have you thought? Thought. It's a difficult one. Thought. <laughs> have, you, have you thought? Have you Talked. Have you thought about me? Have you thought about the class? Have you thought about your homework? Have you thought? Have you thought about it? But yeah, let's change the verb. Let's change the verb. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me see if uh, let me see my day. Do you have a question for the class?
means Espinosa, are you there? Are you there? Somewhere? Hello? Yes, I can hear okay. you now. Can you make a question? That was your mm -hmm. homework, right? Question. One, one yeah. question. You are working now? You are working now? It's not present I'm perfect. Working. I need a present perfect question. Mm -hmm. No sé. You don't know. It was your homework. One question in present perfect. Like, for example, have you eaten, eaten, right? Have you eaten rabbit? Okay. Do you understand? Have you? Yes. Mm -hmm. Have you eaten chicken? Chicken? Oh, but everybody has. Everybody has. That's that's a kind of obvious mm -hmm. question. You can make it like more interesting, yeah. more more. Um, I don't know, more informative. Prepare a question. Prepare your question, please. Got that in my day. Um, Adelie, do you have a question for the class? In present perfect, please. <laughs> I already have it, but you use it right now. Oh, I the use it eating. already. Yeah. Oh, no, no. Do it, do it, do it, please. Do it, please. Okay. Uh, have you eaten yet? Have you eaten what? Have you eaten? You need something. Have you eaten? Have you eaten duck? Duck? Yeah. Oh, duck. Have okay. you eaten duck? Have you eaten duck yet? But you can complete the, the question with some words like, um, have you eaten duck before? No. Just... You don't need to. Okay. You don't need to because present perfect is from the past till the present. Just have you have you eaten duck? Correct. Okay. Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. Answer the question. Me? Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not really. I I haven't. I haven't eaten duck. I mean, not that I know. <laughs> not that I know. You know. Um. People say it's very similar to chicken, but uh, I never tried it before. Have you? No, I haven't. You haven't? Yeah, I haven't. I I don't like it. You don't like, like it. You don't like it. Yeah, I don't like it to try. I don't like to. You don't like to try it. No. <laughs> you don't no. like that idea. No. Ok, si ven cómo pasé la pregunta, have you, ya no necesité repetir toda la pregunta porque estamos en el topic. So, have you, right? I pass you back the question. Have you, what about you, uh, Catherine, have you, have you eaten, have you eaten dog yet? No. I, no, I haven't. No, I haven't. Um... Eaten. My house. I haven't eaten I... duck. No, I haven't eaten duck. No, I haven't eaten duck. And then whatever information you want to add. Mm -hmm. Additional information or you can stop there. Okay. Yeah. Have you eaten duck? Okay. Nice question. Let's see my day, my day, or Catherine, do you have a question now, Catherine, for the class? Um, no sé si está buena, teacher. Um, have you drunk, drunk uh, in the uh, uh, coffee in the afternoon? In drink. A, in the breakfast. Drunk. The breakfast. <laughs> drunk. Have you drunk? Have you drunk? Coffee in the breakfast? For breakfast. For breakfast. For, for uh -huh. breakfast. Have, Have you, you drunk, drunk coffee? Coffee for breakfast? Woo! Salvadorians. Have you drunk coffee for, for breakfast? 
Have you drunk coffee for breakfast? Practice that pronunciation. Repeating that question. Giving it intonation. Remember, a question is rising intonation. Have you drunk? Have you drunk coffee? Have you drunk coffee for breakfast? Have you drunk coffee for breakfast? Repeat it, repeat it, repeat it Have many times. Have you drunk times. coffee for breakfast? That will help you improve your pronunciation, your fluency. Uh, me? Yes, I have. I have drunk coffee once, twice, three times, four times, <laughs> many times. Uh, you know, I am a coffee lover. I am a coffee freak. I am a coffee freak. What about you, Catherine? Have you drunk coffee for breakfast? I know having coffee. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Uh -huh. Coffee. I am. Um, I love milk. So you say, you respond. You respond in present perfect first. No, I haven't drunk coffee. Repeat, no, I haven't drunk coffee. No, I haven't drunk coffee. Because I prefer because milk. Perfect milk. Prefer. Do you know prefer? Perfect. Prefer. P R E F E R prefer. Okay, so you will say, No, I haven't. I haven't drunk coffee because I prefer milk. Do you understand? No, I haven't because prefer. No, I haven't drunk. Complete it with the PP verb. Ah, you need the PP no, verb. No, I haven't drunk coffee. Coffee. No, I no, I haven't drunk coffee but because prefer milk. Because I, because I. Because I prefer milk. Because I prefer milk. Okay, let's do a dynamic. Let's do a dynamic. Student one will say the subject, okay? Student two will say the auxiliary, have or has. Haven't for negative or hasn't, right? And the student three will say the PP verb, okay? A student four may say the compliment. Ready? Ready, ladies, ladies, you can do it. Teacher. Ladies, wake up. Okay. Teacher. Yes? Tengo una pregunta, pero no sé si está correcta. Okay, go ahead. Uh, si sería así, have you sang a song this week? Correct. Have you sung a song this week? Song. It's perfect. Sing, sing, sang, song. Have you sung a song? Have you sung a song? Okay. Good enough. Good enough. <gasps> wow, it's so late. Okay. Ready? Student one. Okay. I start. Adley continue. Catherine continues, my day continues, and Anna finishes. Okay, we're gonna make like a circle right now. Let's go. The subject is we, Adelie? Have. We have, that's correct. Catherine, we have, repeat. We have. Um, PP verb, PP verb. Uh, 18. Eden. Eating. Eating. Repeat. Eating. Eating. Or eaten. Or eaten. eating. Repeat. Eating. Eat. British. British like eaten. Eaten. Eating. American. Eating. 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 Have you eaten? Repeat. Have you eaten? Have you eaten? I have eaten. Oh, es que estamos haciendo una afirmativa, ¿verdad? I have eaten, yes. I have eaten. Okay, my day, continue. I have eaten. I have eaten banana. What? What? Es que no sé. Food, food, any food? Food. Uh -huh. Have you eaten uh, okay. what? Have banana. you eaten Moroccan food. Hey, have you eaten, guys, ladies, have you eaten banana cake? Have you eaten banana cake? No? Yes, I have. 
You have? Yes, I eaten have. Banana cake. You have eaten banana cake? The one yes. that has ban fried banana, beans, cheese. Yes. Oh my gosh, I love it's that delicious. one. I just thought about it. It's, it's so delicious. It's, it's like an empanadas. It's similar to empanadas. Yes, I'm mm -hmm. a lover. I'm an empanada lover. Too. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right, nice job. Nice job. So, my day. ¿Cómo le quedaría, oh. Maide? Repeat, repeat your example. Uh, we have eat, 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 eaten, eaten banana cakes. Okay, we have eaten banana cake. That's that's correct. You can stay there. It's optional to add information. We have eaten banana cake many times we have eaten banana cake in this restaurant we have eaten banana cake um, every birthday or any kind of additional information nice job nice job okay we're going to change now we're going to start with Anna my day Catherine and we'll finish with Adelie ready Anna Anna Lopez yes teacher very good, Miss. I like that attitude, Miss Anna. Okay, the subject is he. Continue, Anna. He. She has. He has. Correct. He has. My day. Continue. He has. He has. Play. Play. Played is very common. Played is very basic. I need a different verb. Okay. Yeah. He has. He has. Swim. 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 Swimming. Are you sure? Swim. Swim. <laughs> you need the PP verb. Class, can you help her? What is this? What is the simple past? What is the past participle of swim? Swim. Swam uh -huh. is the Swam. simple past. <laughs> Adelie, don't do that face to me. Come on. Swim, swam, swam. S W U N G. Swam. Repeat your example, my dear. Oh. Okay. He? He? He, huh? he has hijo. Uh -huh, uh -huh. He has danced. Dance. Cambiémoslo. Danced. Danced. Es más fácil. Okay. Danced. We have danced. Uh -huh. Repeat. We have danced. Dance. No. Complete. Complete. We have danced. We has. We has danced. Oh, it's because we said he. I'm sorry. We said he. Uh -huh. he, he, has he has danced. 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 All night. With T. <laughs> he has danced. Continue, has Catherine. Danced. He has danced uh, with, um, with With his friends. Okay. He has danced with his friends. Repeat, ladies. He has danced with his friends. He has danced with, with his friends. friends. Repeat. He has danced with his friends. He has, he has danced, danced with, with his, friends. his friends. Yes, very good. All right, nice job. Guys, repeating, repeating constantly, okay? Let's <laughs> switch dynamic. Switch dynamic. Okay. Attention. Teacher Kalev is going to give you an answer. Okay. And you have to make the question. Okay. Okay. Again, I will say the answer. Person perfect. And you will make the question. You as a, as a, as a team, as a, as a group, as a class, right? You can help each other, okay? Go ahead. So the first, the first one, first exercise is, yes, she has cooked dinner. Yes. 
Yes, she has cooked dinner. What is the question? Make the question. Has she cooked the dinner? Uh, <laughs> she has cooked dinner. She, she has. Question? Have you cooked? She has. No. Has she cooked? <laughs> Has she cooked? Has she cooked? Has she cooked? Has she cooked? Fish for dinner. Fish for dinner? Okay. Has she cooked fish for dinner? That's correct. That's correct. It matches. It matches the answer. Yes. Nice job. Nice job. You have one point. You have one point. <laughs> <laughs> Exercise two. Exercise two. Yes, they've taken the money. Yes, they've taken the money. Tell me, tell me. Have they... Taken the money? Yes. Can you add one little word at the end? Have they taken all the money? Have they taken have they taken the money? Of yet. Yet, okay. Ah, because you can use yet in the questions. Nice job. Have they taken the money yet? Repeat, ladies. Have they taken the money yet? Have, Have they, they taken the, the money yet? Okay, the verb is pay, pay, P-A-Y. I love that verb, pay, pay, P-A-Y. What is the P-P verb? Paid, no. Paid, P-A-I-D, paid, paid. The answer is? Yes, the company has paid us already. Yes, the company has paid us already. What is the question? Come on, Catherine. Come on, my day, Anna. Come on. Has the company? Yes. The company paid. has paid us already. No, no, vamos hasta que me la digan. <laughs> has the company? Has the company? Has, has the, the company, company paid. Paid, paid us? Paid us? Yet or correct? Has the, has the company paid us yet? Repeat. Has the company paid us yet? Has the company paid us? Paid us. Pay me. Pay you. Us. Paid us. Has the company paid us yet? Has the company the company paid, paid us yet? Has the company paid us yet? Wonderful job, ladies. I'm sorry that I'm squeezing you too much. I'm sorry that I'm putting you too much pressure on a Friday for you. But, you know, it's important to uh, take you out of your comfort zone for a moment. <laughs> okay, ladies, but yes, I need to tell you something. I don't give you big homeworks. I give you a small homework, okay? So when I give you a small homework, try to do it. Try to do it because there is a purpose. There is a purpose. We have many uh, conversation uh, necessity, you know, in this, in this module. So it's important to practice. One of your classmates shared... Um, a list of verbs on the WhatsApp chat in case you didn't have one. You can access to that one. You can download it to your cell phone, to your computer, have it handy, practice it. 
practice it, please. It's really important. Okay. So I guess do you have any question, any comment, anything to say? No, you're sleepy already, huh? You're sleepy already. Okay, <laughs> go get some sleep. Go get some sleep. I studied too much with you. <laughs> I'll see you on Monday. You have a nice weekend. Goodbye, everyone. Bye. Okay. Goodbye. goodbye. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. See you Bye. later. See you later. Goodbye. Happy. Happy weekend. Happy night. Happy night. Happy weekend. Happy night. Have a have a happy night. Have a, have have a, a happy, happy weekend. Have a nice weekend. Goodbye, Catherine. Say goodbye, Catherine. Goodbye, teacher. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, classmates. Bye, classmates. Classmates. Bye. Goodbye, classmates. Goodbye, Anna. Happy weekend for you. Happy weekend, Catherine. You. Goodbye. You too. Goodbye, teacher. Take care.